These are strange days. A lot of people don't know what to make of them. The Rainbow Children Project is a great place to start. Cleedon Academy are leading the way and bringing out new colours. My name is Greg McGee and I am an artist. Now, though culture is in quarantine, creativity continues. I need you to be an artist too. You're going to pick up a black pen and you're going to draw your future. I'm talking about the word hope. Now, hope's a very strong word. You might hope for things different when the lockdown finishes. Um, that might include your family. It might include your friends. It might include your home or the places you play. Either way, your artwork is going to be awesome. Let's go. We are going to go with cartoon characters. The best place to start with a cartoon character is the eyes. Come over here, come and have a look. Don't you worry about the thing. The best thing to do with features is just break them down into simple shapes. The eye looks like half of an egg with a black crescent inside. Draw the eyebrow, nice simple one and maybe a bit of a thoughtful one over here. And the ear is like half of a love heart with a question mark inside with no dot on the bottom and a little squiggle inside. And there's the nose and a big wide emoji like smile. You know what I'm talking about. Now the hair kind of looks like the leaves on a Christmas tree. There you go. If you wanted it to be a girl, feminize her with some eyelashes and make the hair a bit longer maybe. I'm not generalizing things here. I'm just talking about cartoons. And that goes like that, and there you go. She's beautiful! Now that's the face done. The figure's a lot easier than you think. It's bigger than the head, and the limbs bend. The claws that are wrapped around the figure crease and wrinkle, so the lines need to be wobbly. Come over and have a look. So here we go. Now like I say, limbs bend, claws wrinkle. Don't you worry about the thing. Just make sure that arm has two lines. One, two. It is strong enough to carry something. And this leg is strong enough to carry the body that is placed on top of it. So we've got the face, we've got the figure, now it's time for the colour and ink pencils. The best, one of the best things to do with flesh tone is to get an orange and then go really lightly on top. Then you go even lighter with the red. If your character is of a different ethnicity, get it brown and slightly drizzle a brown darker colour on top. Make it look really slow and sensitive. I want you to imagine the surface of the paper is too hot for the tip of the pencil so you are just gently colouring in all in one direction. Then you get the red and you go slightly, slightly red over the orange that you've already done. Maybe a little bit darker where the cheeks are. And then you get your finger and you smudge into it. That's how you blend the flesh tone. If you want her to be a bit darker, just a bit of brown on top. Who's going to pass me a yellow? Not me. So I've got two blues and I'm going to just very sensitively colour in the limbs and the body. There's absolutely no need to damage the surface of the paper. And where the outlines are, you can go a little bit darker with a similar colour, so dark blue around the outlines, just to, to give it a bit of heft, a bit of 3D swagger. Now I'm really enjoying this, creativity is what it's all about. Isla, can you pass me the black pen please? This is the secret, once you've got the colour done, once you've got the pencil done, you get the black fine liner or black ink, and you go around the side, around the outline, carefully. Get the black ink done after you've got the colour on because if you try and smudge the drawing and it's got black ink on it, the ink will spread and it will muddy up your colours. It just won't look as good as it should do. Here is a speech bubble. You just draw the shape of an egg like that. You leave a gap for a lightning flash and the lightning flash goes to the mouth of the person who is speaking. So there you go, hopefully you can draw hope too. You've already inspired my family. Cleedon Academy and the Rainbow Children Project and the values of believe, inspire, excel are great inspirations. And remember, draw your characters in your uniform. Let's show the world just what the artists of Cleedon Academy can do. I want you to draw it, I want you to photo it, and then I want you to send it 
art camp at accordingtomcgee.com. Let's talk soon. I cannot wait to see your artwork. Woo!